Welcome back to Collect the Toys. And today we're going to do an unboxing of January's month of Loot Crate. Woohoo! I'm so excited to see what's in Loot Crate. It feels kind of heavy this month. So let's see what we get in here. Loot Crate is a, if you don't know what it is, it's like a monthly subscription box. Kind of like anything from 1UP Box to My Geeky Goodies, all those kind. Loot Crate is my one of my absolute favorite ones. Especially because there's a lot of... Um, you know, exclusive items in here and things you can only get in Loot Crate. I'll leave their link down below in the description box. So, um, let's get into this and see. As you guys can see, I have never opened this yet, so it's a sealed box. I haven't watched anything on any of these unboxings. I try not to before I open these so I can be really surprised and see what I get. So, let's see. Let's show you guys first everything that's in there. Woo! I can't wait to see everything. Ooh, so it looks like this is a good month. I believe their theme for this month I did read was Rewind, so that's really cool. Ooh, there's some awesome looking stuff in here, guys. So as always, it does say Rewind. This is their um, monthly, like, um, box, and it, I mean, their, like, um, magazine or um, booklet, you know, type of thing, telling you everything that's in um, the box. It does say that this month we're spinning the heads, hands of time backwards to rewind. It doesn't matter how old or young you are, there's always something from the past that's hard not to love. Whether you love to reminisce on dropping quarters in your favorite arcade game with your best friends or wishing you could still watch your favorite Saturday morning cartoons, get ready to sit back and rewind. That's super awesome, guys. I think that's cool, especially for us older, like, adult collectors because, um... You know, we're, we really love all this nostalgic stuff, and I really love it myself. So, um, so that's really cool. So, um, that'll be cool to see everything in here, and I'll get into the details about what everything is. So, there's a lot of cool. Let's start off with the pin. I really like this pin. It's one of the best ones I've seen so far. It says, Loot Create Rewind, January uh, 2015. That is an awesome pin, guys. I love collecting pins, if you didn't know. So that's super cool to add to my collection. Um, so let's start off with, uh, the box to show you what it looks like. You know, each month they do have something on the box, something kind of like, um, you know, themed and stuff. But I think this box, honestly, this month is not as good as their past boxes. Um, it's a really nice box and stuff, but it just doesn't have as much detail or things you can do with the box. But setting that aside, we did get number one of the Star Wars um, comic books. These are really, really cool. I always keep all my comics from uh, Loot Crate in the box. I mean, in the bag. I don't take them out. So that's a really cool comic. Um, we also did get a comic notebook. Ooh, this is super cool. Let's take a look at this, guys, and see what it is. So it's just like a pocket notebook. Ooh. It says, a notebook for when inspiration strikes, cartooning tips, and a tear-out balloon template for sight gags, character studies, and heroics. That's really cool. So here's what the cover looks like, guys. Super awesome. And then, it just looks like this. Things you can, like, write notes and, oops, notes and stuff, I guess. So, that's really cool. Um... And then in the back, there's just this little, like, um, pop-out template. That's really cool. So I think that's cool. I really like this one. I always love notebooks, and you can never have too many. So that's a really cool one. So I like that. I also got... Oh, sorry for that. Some, like, pixelated glasses. I think these are cool. Let me quickly take these off to show you what they look like. I'm a little blind without those, but... Oh, wow. Those are awesome, guys. I think these are cool. How do I look? What do you think? Let me know down in the comments below. I think these are really awesome glasses. I actually might wear them out, especially on sunny days. So that's super cool. I like those a lot, guys. I think it's one of my favorite items so far. And then... We also got this So Analog Tendo Loot Crate Exclusive. I'm not sure what this is. Um, let's see what it is. I kind of don't want to take it apart, but I do want to see what it is. Very interesting. Whoa. 
this looks pretty awesome. Let's put in. Oh wow, this is really cool. Oh, I think this is like one of the things similar to. Um, now I know what Enderworm was talking about when he left me a comment in saying that I'll um, under like. Well, Enderworm had um, Enderworm's gaming and toys had left me a comment about saying that when I open my geeky goodies, I'll understand what he means by there's something that he and X Y Adventures had opened before. And uh, this is super awesome. I've never had one of these, and I've actually wanted one of these. Oh my word, this is amazing. Oh, I'm so excited, guys. As you can see from the smile on my face, this is amazing. I've always wanted one of these. Oh, these are so cool. And this is a Loot Crate exclusive one, so that's really cool. So you can get these, but this is like Loot Crate exclusive, and it does come with like the Nintendo... Whoa, they're kind of hard to keep the arms in, guys, so... Oh dropping it okay so this is a really really cool guy i really like him wow that is super awesome i think this is amazing let me see if i can get him well maybe not like that okay so he's a very delicate character so but that's what he looks like and he has his little gun and everything i think that's super awesome especially for the rewind that's a super cool one kobe's alley Kid, Squad Kids Inc. For, for Geeks by Geeks. That's super funny. I love this. I can't wait to display this on my shelf, guys. Oh, that's so awesome. So I really like that little figure. So that's what that was. That's an amazing thing. Oh, my word. Oh, I'm so excited about that. So I'm going to save the best for last. I'm not sure what this is. It says blacktiegeek.com. Um... I want to open this, but it's kind of... Oh, I think this is just a tie, guys. Nothing... Yeah. Um, so it's just a tie. Of course, I don't wear ties, but this is a cool-looking tie and all. So that's really cool, and it's pretty interesting. So, you know. As for, um, um, items every month, and it's so hard to not want to, like, subscribe to them or to keep subscribing to them. I mean, you know, it's just a really great box. And overall, I think for the value and the money, it's worth every penny. And you guys, they do have programs on there where if you refer friends, you get money off and things like that. So definitely check out Loot Crate. I think they're awesome. And the last and final thing I got was a t-shirt. Ooh, I think I know what this is. This looks really, really awesome. Oh, wow. If you are a... um. Oh, sorry, I'm blanking out right now, but if you are a fan of this, sorry, I can't think of it. Um, oh, I, oh, it's going to come to me, but I'll see in the pamphlet, but that is a super awesome t-shirt. I think that is amazing. So, let's see what the pamphlet says that everything was. So, it is, again, Rewind was the name of this month. So, oh, here's the Mega Crate, guys. Every month they give away, like, a special Mega Crate. So the Epic Crate, they call it. So that's what you could win from this month's Epic Crate if you did win. They only pick one winner every month, so. First thing was this exclusive retro arcade skinny tie. That's what this black tie was. Um, it says, it's sleek and it's chic. It's black tie. Inspired by one of our favorite early arcade games, this stylish skinny tie makes the perfect accessory for both guys and gals that's really cool i like the way the girl's wearing it because at first i was like this is a tie i don't really wear ties but it's super awesome that was again the black tie and you can find them at blacktiegeek.com if you're looking for it uh the next thing was nintendo exclusive tendo figure kid kid squad inc the retro they're inspired they're so analog so many of some may think these miniature games, cartridges, are a thing of the past, but we think they still have legs and arms and feet and accessories too. Standing three inches tall, these figures are inspired by our favorite NES console games for the 80s and 90s. Six in all, including a super rare gold variant. Some easy assembly required. So that's what that was, and this is the figure I got. Again, up close and personal so you guys can see them. 
Let me know down in the comments below if you guys like me reading off what's in this uh, little booklet. If not, I, w I don't have to do it. I just thought that it's kind of cool for people who don't get this kind of subscription box and would like to know a little more detail about each thing and item I get. And then there was also the Star Wars exclusive. It says exclusive Star Wars comic book issue one. It says, would you look at the cover? Who else but Loot Crate? could enlist Solo and Chewie to deliver our crates throughout the galaxy. We're not going to spoil the story for you, but, they, but they're definitely defenders of the crate. So that's that. And then again, we got the exclusive Voltron t-shirt, as you guys all saw. This is super awesome. I really like this t-shirt a lot. And it just says, whether you're defending the universe, defending your place on the sofa, you're, you'll look Look great doing it in the uber exclusive t-shirt designed available to a chosen few. You the Loot Crate community. It's contemporary fit is soft and comfortable and flatters any physique. So those are those two items. And here's what it looks like and stuff. That's super awesome. And then you have uh, both the comic book notebook which is this one, the comic book notebook. It says, after you're finished reading the Star Wars comic book one, create your own with this handy notebook that features blank comic book panels and stencils for dialogue bubbles and other shapes. Compact size fits in your back pocket. Your big ideas are all that's needed. 60 pages, so that's super awesome. And then you also have the pixelated uh, exclusive 8-bit glasses, Loot Crate Lab. For 2015, we're dressing you in all of our finery. They're stylish and durable. 8-bit glasses will protect your peeps from the sun's harmful UV rays while upping your coolness quota. They make they may look retro, but remember, orange is a new black. So that's super cool. And then it looks like there's just little um like a punch out of a Nintendo controller. So that's really cool. I like that one. I think that's awesome. So, let me know down in the comments below, what was your favorite item from Loot Crate this month? I think I have three favorite items. I really liked everything in this Loot Crate a lot, but one of my favorite things that I got was definitely this Nintendo little um, analog toy. Thanks again, Enderworms Gaming and Toys, for telling me something cool was in the box. I had no idea what you were talking about, especially because Loot Crate does exclusive things, so I was like, You've opened something, but you don't get Loot Crate. What could it be? So I think that is super awesome. That's one of my top picks. Um, the glasses were another top pick. Ooh. And I believe that I really, really, really love this t-shirt this month. I think it's super stylish. It's retro, but it's cool looking. It's still relevant to this time. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And share with your friends. Tell them about Loot Crate. And if you do subscribe, please let me know what you thought of this month's Loot Crate. And I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. And I'm glad to be back.